Hello everyone, welcome back to my Unreal Engine tutorial series on how to create an open world game. So this time what I'm going to do is I have uh, some problems with my kick-in system that I implemented last, last time. So here when I kick this character like this uh, you can see the blood splatter and the sound is same as this uh, sword attack like this so instead that kicking sound should be different and also the blood particle should be different so that I'm going to implement that in such a way that when I am attacking with a different weapon the attack sound or the block sound or the hit sound both of them will be different so that is uh, one more advancement in our custom weapon system so that we depending on the type of weapon I attack the hit sound will be different and same goes to the kick in as well right so let's get started and uh, as always this episode is sponsored by these generous patreons thank you very much for the support you are giving me that is very helpful to me okay back to the tutorial so I'll first open my character the main character which is CH human and first I'll show you so this is under check hit this is where I play the hit sound and here now uh, for now I have just given a cut sound like this so this is okay for a sword cut but not okay for a kick or any other type of weapon so I'm gonna define I'm gonna promote this sound to a variable like this promote to variable and I'll name it hit sound only to be simple and I'll put it under the category sounds okay now as for the default sound I'll leave the cut sound right so let's fix that first and then let's come into the particle okay now where should I change this so let me close these unwanted tabs okay so under fight I when I this is where I attack so when I attack I should set that variable let's say I'll do it right after this one set hit sound and as so this is normal attacking with the weapon now I'll get a reference to current weapon and get well I should uh, I'll open the weapon blueprint and here I'll define a new a new variable called hit sound I'll name it enemy hit sound and this should be 
a sound base and here as for the default sound I'll put cut right now I need a method to get this default uh, this hit sound out so I'll define a new function here get hit sound I always type all capital and output should be a sound base sound okay now I'll implement that interface here get hit sound and return this okay now I need so this is the only cut sound I have I need a different sound for the X and also the kick and for the kick sound I'm gonna use this and this is uh, the swoosh for the kick and yeah and for the X sound I don't have a proper another sound so I'll keep the same cut sound okay now here let's back to the ch human character blueprint here I should get hit sound like this and set here and similarly when I punch uh, not punch when I kick as kicking right here yeah when I kick I should set and then set hit sound and for the hit sound I have to use this one now yeah now I think that's all now in the check hit I am already playing the hit sound so yeah this should be all let's check play the game and run kick right right so right so this is for the sword cut sound and for the kick this kick sound and for the X actually I didn't change the sound effect if I had changed that would be a different sound also let's quickly fix that uh, swoosh sound for the kicks so where do I play right this is the kick montage and I should play that sound right here play sound and for the sound effect I should use this one so that the kicking would be more interesting like this okay so yeah that's all I wanted to show you today yeah so that's all I wanted to show you today and thank you for watching I hope you learned something 
in the next video let's work on how to implement different uh, particle effects uh, for the for different types of attacks uh, like when I'm kicking instead of there's a blood splatter there should be some kind of a dust puff or something so because uh, kicking does not always emit blood and when I cut with the sword like we already have we should splatter blood all right and if you want to support my work you can go to patreon.com till the prima series and you can get the membership of my channel my page and depending on the membership you get you will have different privileges and for this open world developers you will have the access to complete project files and for the fellow developers you will have access to like parts of code and yeah and also you can ask any question in there all right so see you in the next episode goodbye